Hello, I'm Mr. Nut, and I'm playing Grand Theft Auto 5. And as you can see, Franklin is, of course, wearing his signature hockey scuba mask thing. Okay, seriously, I have no idea how exactly this happened. I was just walking through a bunch of chairs, and then suddenly I just noticed he's wearing that. Anyway, this today I'll be doing a challenge thing. Yep, I'll just be, um,. I'll uh, just make my way over to a taxi depot thingamajig and then I'll explain it for anyone who didn't pay much attention to the video title. Yeah. Right, here we are at the taxi place. Oh, hang on, no. Then here we are at the taxi place. See, that is a phone number you could probably dial in the game. Maybe. I don't know, I never tried it. Because, you know, he's got it on contacts why would I bother say so yeah, the challenge or rather should I say the quest you know from the title is basically this I'll take this taxi I'll do a bunch of them you know taxi jobs all while using you know the cinematic mode yeah of course this will be challenging because well I don't know have you ever tried driving a cinematic mode it's not easy of course, I got to to get rid of the radio station because, well, okay, I don't know. There we go. <laughs> That's the alarm going off, and here's cinematic mode. Yep, this sort of go well. Okay, hey, taxi job. I got it. All right, where is it? Ah, oh, convenient. Just around this corner. No, no, the other corner. There we go, that's the direction you need to go in. Already proving this how smoothly this will go, aren't I? Hey you. So basically what I do is I just do this and see how much money I can make before totaling the car and I don't know why I let go of the cinematic mode while she got into the taxi. I mean, you could have sought some dramatic getting into taxi action right there. Okay. It's going to be harder to break, considering the fact I've got my thumb permanently on, you know, circle, so of course this means I can't hit X. Okay. You know, I don't need brakes. I mean, see, I mean, you know, driving down anyway, you don't need brakes. I mean, it's driving instructors that make up that kind of stuff because brake companies obviously pay them to do that. Yep. Okay, I was able to get the brakes there, just through skill, my thumb skills, that I've developed over years from video gaming. Well, actually, I'd say this is going well. I mean, so far, I've still got the thing on the top of the taxi. You know, the thing with the advert on it, that seems to come off really easily. No, it isn't. I mean, what, what do you think, this car's made of paper or something? I keep clutch that language, lady. Okay, this way. I'd say this taxi job's going pretty well. Well, of course I could try. See, I got this license. Probably. I mean, I want to get this job if you know, I couldn't drive. Because I am totally officially with the company, and if you've got any problems, take it to the company. Yep. Just uh, vaguely describe me, and I'm sure they'll figure out who it is. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, here you go. Here's a name that I found in the taxi. Um. It, uh, hi, May. Yeah. That that's me. Okay. Just getting around this traffic here. Of course, like I got a driving ability which I can't activate because then I'd have to take my thumb off of the the, the button. Oh, there you go. Okay, so that's um 160. Gotta write that down so I can keep track of how much. Oh, what the hell? This pen is cursed. 
Well, I just started writing it and it just popped away. Stupid broken piano that's found in this room. Okay. What? Uh, no. Yeah. Uh, oh. What? Okay. Cool. Let me know if you got a pick up for me. There we go. <laughs> Those few seconds right don't now. count. Also, it appears I got someone angry. Who knew randomly hitting complete strangers would result in anger? Okay, I, I, I'm sure I can help drive these losers in cinematic mode. And now I'm in this thing. This isn't good. <laughs> this isn't good at all. Okay, just follow the mini map in the lower left corner of the screen. And yes, I will forever reference that tutorial guy in line in Age of Empires. Okay. I'm sure you didn't need whatever the hell that bit was. Oh, and the thing on the top's gone. Well, obviously it's gone now. Okay, you, lady. What a man. I, actually, I don't know who I'm picking up. Hey, it's Bill Cosby. You can tell from his stripy sweater. Yep. And it's to tie. It's you know. Yeah, so you want to go this place. You made a wise decision choosing Franklin Taxi Company. Oh yeah, there's another one. What, have you been with one of these guys before? Oh yeah, right, right, of course. You must have um, driven with Michael before. Okay. Just, I'm going to safely make it over to that place over there. Uh-huh. What, is this little bump in the path there? Oh, so continuing a straight line and... Oh, who the hell hired you? Oh, uh, the dead, um... Better get going. You know, I don't want to be associated with that dead guy. Who can't drive. Yeah, he crashed because he can't drive. And had nothing to do with me at all. No, sir. Okay. Um, the, uh, the road didn't need that anyway. Not one. Yes, yes, it's another one. Okay, can you say something else? Like, what, what happened to that guy who's like, Is this what fans have, not, have fans like? Or something. You know, as I'm rolling down the hill, losing all four doors and the hood. Yep, that, that's, that, that, that was just perfect, you know. Because, yes, that is what fun's like. Having your car roll down a hill as most of it falls off. My ride. And now I'm not just deliberately crashing it into everything. It's just, I obviously am very bad at driving anyway. And, well, this isn't helping. Okay, let's try to avoid. Six feet, okay. I can I can do this. I'm swerving around like an idiot, but I'm doing it. Seriously, you need to stop whining, dude. I didn't know Bill Cosby was such a whiner. I thought he was too busy talking about Jello pudding and Kodak Coke or something. Kodak pudding, yeah, that's it. The new Kodak pudding. Because also talking to kids about stuff. Um, okay, look, I'll be honest, I don't know a whole lot about Bill Cosby. Yeah, no problem. Okay, so that's 232. I think that's 30. Ah, oh, whatever. I'll just write down 232. Because that's what I saw. Okay, two. Perfect. Okay, um, so who's the next, um, yeah, customer? Timing. I got a customer for you 
Fantastic. Where are they? It's always behind, isn't it? Oh yeah, I'm actually right quite close, aren't I? I ain't that convenient. You know, normally by now I'd be out in the middle of nowhere. And it looks like this taxi job's actually driving me back into the city for a change. I mean, no, yeah, not normally I'd notice it's like progressively takes me out further and further away until I notice, hang on, these taxi jobs are just gradually taking me to Trevor's house. Except I haven't unlocked Trevor yet. So how do I know this is Trevor's house? Well, okay, I have unlocked Trevor now. And I don't know, you could probably tell or some somehow from how far I got in the game from looking at I don't know, Franklin's dress sense than Franklin's home, I don't know. But anyway, um obviously I didn't quite own this game quite as long as most YouTubers, you know, where they seem to have had it out had this game since it came out, but you know, I I, I had my reasons. You know, for not getting it immediately. Even though I did sing in that one video that I like to play GTA and stuff. Hmm. Well, what? You're not going to get a big old song out, out of me in this video. It's just not happening. I never got the entire song done. Because you know, I'm not going to. I ain't going to write that whole thing. Also, are you back there? Thanks for not commenting on my driving. Oh, I'll, I'll take that back. Of course I could drop. Look, look, this this pedal over here. This is the this is the gas. This over here. This is the brakes. And the 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 the, 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 the taxi broke. I broke the taxi. Okay, so that brings me to a grand total of. Let's see now. Uh -huh. uh. Boop. Boop, boop, boop. 392 uh-huh but I only did like 12 minutes okay you know what fine I'll go back to the taxi depot see if I can do better okay here we are at the taxi depot again but um, as I should probably mention that uh, lost that door lost there absolutely nothing to do with me no, actually, seriously, I did not do that. Anyway, now let's check if this car's alarmed. Oh, that's not alarmed. What? It's it's it's, it's tried and tried and tested method of like alarm checking. See, no alarm. Therefore, it's yeah, safe to take. Let's ignore all the broken glass now in, embedded in Franklin's arm. Right, so um, yeah, that's that radio must go off. You know, not only copyright claims. Yeah, depot. What's what's going on? Yeah, no, it's dispatch, and they keep calling it depot, but I don't care. They call it what I damn well like. This is Franklin's Taxi Company. Ignore the fact that you know, I haven't exactly bought it yet, but I will eventually once Franklin accumulates the money necessary Even though from what I've read, you know um, Buying purchases, uh, so purchasing properties isn't exactly all that profitable Oh, well, hey, I like doing taxi jobs, so what, what's the worst that could happen from purchasing this one? All right, chariot racing now. Um, I kind of lost the horse, so you mind getting out pulling? Oh, whatever. Okay, I guess it's a good thing we got one of those automated chariots, which you know are very common these days. Well, let me tell you, yeah, you know, they used to be pretty darn rare back in the day. But Franklin doesn't remember that because he's only like 12 compared to the other protagonists. 
Yeah, it would do it, of course, uh, Michael being like a billion years old. And there's Grandpa Trevor, who's older than Michael. No, no not Michael, um, oh, well, Franklin. Don't know why he got the names mixed up. Probably because I'm full on stupid right now. Also, I think I lost that, um, yeah, I lost it. I've lost the thing on top. Quit calling it a chariot. We ain't chariot racing, and you ain't Julius Caesar, who will win, like, no matter what. Damn. This guy really has an obsession with the, you know, the Romans. Oh, don't worry. I don't need that. I'll quit calling me a fool. I mean, who's the one who got into this taxi, huh? Who got into a taxi with a broken windshield? In fact, a complete lack of windshield. I mean, I'd, call you, I'd say that would be the fall in this situation. Uh, I ain't respecting nothing. Wait, that's double negatives. So I am respecting something. Look, I'm really not... I'm, I'm seriously not deliberately driving and everything I just obviously don't have the reaction skills necessary for you know driving in this mode okay also not being able to break so easily is also a hindrance here I mean what you try driving around like a maniac with barely any visibility and, uh, you know, like I said, no brakes. But, you know, you can just pretend that Trevor just came along and just cut all the brakes on these things. Except the fact that occasionally I do successfully use the brakes. Okay, 191. Awesome. Okay. Yes, I know it's on 191. Shut up. I know maps. Let me know if you got a pickup for me. Guys, just cancel on me. So there's a job near you right now. Huh, I could switch around the camera thing. It gotta be all dramatic as you take off in the taxi. So yeah, it must be great uh, this button here. Just considering that I can't Hmm, hang on a minute. Wait a minute, I got an idea. I have, yeah, you know, how about I get some tape and hold down the button? All right, I'll be right back. Okay, now I'm back. So, yeah, you're probably wondering, hey, why are you in menu mode? Well, I'll show you. Well, you see, it's because, um, for some reason, just leaving the taxi out for a while resulted in people wanting me dead. Yeah, that made sense. You know, I, I, apparently I can make enemies by doing nothing. Oh, seriously? Look, this is the, that's not even fair. That's not even fair at all. Okay, fine. Another reset. Okay, find another taxi. Find him need to go to the depot. That's better. Okay. Hey. There we go. There's the button. Yeah. Holding it down itself. Oh, yeah, I'll take that cool. Where is he? Hopefully this time people won't just randomly start shooting me for no reason. No, seriously. I, I wasn't even doing anything. I was going away, hitting anyone. Maybe that's why he started hitting me. Because I was just holding up traffic. Oh, there you go. That's the American way. Someone holding up slightly in traffic. And, oh, okay, it looks like my tape solution isn't quite holding quite as well as I thought it would. I mean, I tried blue tack, but, oh, well, it wasn't blue tack, but I tried this sticky thingamajig, blob thing, but that didn't quite hold as well. Um, or at all, really. I mean, it worked back when I did that 
when I did this thing in Ratchet and Clank where I halt, you know, just sort of just left the game, breaking an infinite amount of boxes, earning money, or bolts, which is money, whatever. Oh yeah, of course, I got taxi music on. Gotta turn that off. How could I forget that? Okay, so I don't know, hopefully the the the, um, the lower volume of the game will be able to excuse the fact that I had music playing for a few seconds there. Also, my talking. No, it isn't. I'm more likely to get shot to death than this thing falling apart. And in some rare cases, it, it, it expel yeah, just exploding. Okay, fine. Looks like I'll have to hold down the button after all. And only occasionally applying the brake. You know, whenever I seem to find it possible. Yes, I can drive. Quit questioning my driving ability. Um, yeah, I meant to drive on the pavement. Gotta do things saint style. And you can tell from the name that they really are a bunch of saints. Really, really good people, then. How about driving around that taxi, the, 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 the car? I'm in the taxi. Hmm. Uh, okay, I, I managed to not hit that guy. And that's good. Because I don't want to crash, because that's bad. And... Um, no, no, I'm not entirely sure where I'm going with that at all. Not even in the slightest. Okay, so this does stop this hill, huh? This camera angle is really helping. Yeah. I wonder, is there actually a system for picking these out, or is it just randomly just switching out whenever it feels like it? Because that's what it feels like. Uh, oh dear. That doesn't look good. Well, if you start worried, how about you get out of the car? Huh? Ever thought of that? I mean, there's been times where I've been kind of stationary. So you had plenty of chance to escape the taxi rider Franklin. Well, that seemed breakable. Uh, right. So, uh, commentary. I need commentary. That is why you're watching the video, because commentary and me doing a stupid challenge where I attempt to do something stupid. People love those on YouTube. No! No, I, c I could drive that guy over there. And not. Obviously. I am well within traffic laws right now. Wait, hang on, it's a 35 um, speed limit. How fast is this, how fast is this thing going? Where's the speedometer? Oh no, wait, of course I forgot. Speeding laws don't apply to GTA protagonists. Because, I don't know, how fun would that be? You know, oh, you, you're going one mile over the speed limit, um, you know, one mile per hour over the speed limit, uh, you know, it, it's the cops. That'll hunt you down as if you've committed murder of the president. So, $260, huh? Yeah, that's yeah, pretty good. Okay. Sweet. Should be pretty easy to beat the top, the, yeah, the top score so far. Which I'm sure you know. Um, because you've watched the video up to this point. Unless if for some reason you decide, hey, I'm just gonna go skip across like high, over half the video. I'm sure this seems like a good idea. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, hang on. Hang on. I haven't taken a taxi job. I'm just following the purple line. But I should probably get rid of that purple line. There we go. And now that won't be a problem ever again. Hey, they're conveniently just right over there. That's convenient. You. Uh, where are they? Come over to my taxi. 
I don't know, would you get into a taxi like looking like this? I know I would. That'd be fun. Look out for the cows. Alright, I'll look out for them. Um, where are the cows? At. Dog. Yep, I'm hip and modern. As you can tell from there. Hey, a shortcut. Um, time for a... Hang on, wait a minute. Why wasn't it in cinematic view? Oh, for God's sakes. Show some respect to the chariot, homie. How much was I driving out of cinematic mode? If I, if I'm probably going to have to go cancel this taxi job, won't I? You damaged the chariot, fool. I'm sorry, dude. I'm going to have to cancel on this taxi job. Um, you know, because I wasn't driving in cinematic mode. And that's just against the rules right there. Uh, how about you get out the taxi? Now, out the taxi. Shut up. Get your face back in motion. I know how to steer a chariot. Out the taxi. I'm going to need a different guy. A guy that could appreciate cinematic mode. Let me know if you got a pickup for me. I got a pickup that's too far from you. Now. You can get that one to me. Yeah, cool. I don't know, I can okay. I, I gotta feel like a right yeah, idiot when I'm looking over the video and it turns out I was actually driving most of that in cinematic mode. Ah, oh, whatever. What's done is done. And I'm sure the brakes button will be good enough as a not brakes, the reverse button. Hello, lady. You saw me crash through that fence, right? That way you know I'm a good enough taxi guy. See, I even got the door permanently open for you because I'm a gentleman. And yeah, that's what gentlemen do. They hold doors open for the lady. I then get called out on it or something. I don't know. Or well, in fact, in some cases, they remove the door completely. You know, then they get, like, thanked for, for, for being really practical in their assistance because now you know when you won't go through that door again they don't have to wait for you to open it for them it's amazing okay oh you want you, you want to go out over to this place look this may look like a dodgy situation but i can get out of it see i mean if you managed to drive in there the chances are you could drive out of it And look, there's a, there's a circle on the map. Uh, that means it's just in this direction. And that is a river. And I am quite obviously not driving some kind of modified boat car thing. Shit. My head. Oh, it's a guy in the back. Why well, did I think I was driving around a lady? Oh, whatever. I blame the camera angle and pink shirt. That that's what made me think. Lady. It's pink jumper actually. Oh whatever. Oh that's a train. Well it's a good thing I didn't drive up there. It's not your ride. It's my ride. Okay, I'll lie, it's not my car either. It's Franklin Company's car. Which would make it my car. In, um, a sense. Okay, whatever. Look, okay, fine. Look, I'm following the trail again. You happy, picky customer guy? Shit. That was a thing. I mean, if only cinematic camera picked that up more dramatically, but uh, whatever, that'll do. I mean, I landed. I've still got all four tyres. Very likely. And oh, cock, what's, who put all these rocks there? I want them removed. Uh, by the... Um... Uh, anyone. No. 
The rock removing. The Franklin's rock removing company. Yeah, Franklin owns a lot of companies, apparently. Because, I don't know, Franklin. He's prepared for this kind of crap. Okay, it's around here somewhere. There we go, that's the exact... Oh, 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 we're playing this game, huh? We're playing this game. You think you're Billy Badass? Oh, well, let's see if you're so badass after I shoot the brains out of you. Fantastic. Now he's dead. Okay, 162. Okay. Perfect. I'm doing pretty good this time. Um, except uh, now I've got to get away from the cops. Uh oh. That can't be good. Oh, don't worry, I got the trusty Franklin Mobile. Oh. A taxi too damaged to do taxi jobs. Oh, okay, fine. Whatever. I don't need your stupid taxi. I got that speedboat over there. Um, while I go do that, I'm gonna do some sums to go figure out just how well exactly I did. Uh, let's see here. Uh, one. Uh, 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 Sixty. Plus one sixty-two, four hundred twenty-two. Top score. I think that's better. Than, that's obviously better than the first attempt. But yeah, um, I. That's about as much as I could be bothered to try this. Uh, yeah, I know, if you could do better, um, post it in the comments or whatever. That that's a thing. Um, so yeah, that that's obviously the first of my quests thing. Yeah, I'd be judging for the fact that I, I put a special title up, that title up there. I intend to do more of these quests. In fact, I'd love to hear suggestions if you got any ideas for quests. I mean, it doesn't have to be a GTA. I mean, it obviously has to be a game I own, but yeah. Anyway, till next time, goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>